warm welcome to Spunugwazi, a show that is made especially for you, a show that is made to enlighten, inform and clarify you. At last, something that will act as the eyes, the ears and the voice of students. All of this made, of course, possible by you, the students. My name is Elizabeth Matilso de Bela and I'll be your host for the duration of the show. On today's show, my panel of guests consists of the previous SRC presidents and our current SRC presidents. Stay tuned as I clobber them with questions. Spoon of glass. My next guest is Mr. Rangwezi Mudao. Thank you very much for joining us, most Spoon of glass. All of you, you are welcome. Uh, Mr. Mdao, the position that you held in the previous SRC, correct me if I'm wrong, was that of Deputy President? Uh, yes, indeed it was. Was that the only position that you held? Uh, well, I also had uh, a position on, on, at the central level uh, where I was the, the Deputy President external. So those were the positions that you yes, held yes, yes. while in office? Yes. Okay. The other one? was that I, I was the head of, 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 di of the dis discipline committee uh, within the SRC. Okay. Did you have a mandate from the students? Yeah, well indeed we, we, we had a mandate for, from students. Like a um, uh, student had to, 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 to request us to go and represent them when they were not registering. You cannot have any, any university resource uh, based on uh, uh, personal agendas. You need to do, for you to, to access uh, university uh, resources, you must be represent, representing students. So what you're saying is that there's, there's no such thing? There's no such things. I mean, uh, uh, people always wrote things, I know. People always wrote uh, hurricanes uh, about the SRCs, but, you know, there's, there's, there's actually no reality on that. Uh, and I must say that, you know, we, 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 we condemn that because it's, it's, it's wrong for people to go and, and, and write about others. You, you know, some people were, were insulted in, in, the, in, in, in those papers. You know, it's, 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 it's wrong. I must say that it's wrong. And, you know, it's unprofessional. Because in studio at this moment, we've got Mr. Tsokofato Minyato. Thank you very much for joining us, Moskunuwa. Thank you for inviting me to this lovely program of yours. Mr. Tsokofato Minyato is our current president at the SRC office. Am I right? Yes. Uh, so, what is your vision or motto as the current SRC? Well, the current SRC is faced, uh, it comes into office and it's faced with lots of challenges. One of those challenges is that as an institution that has been recently merged, uh, there are lots of things that confront us as the SRC. One of those being major, the second one being academic and financial exclusion. But as an SRC, once you become corrupt, mm -hmm. you fall and you play in the hands of management. They are easy to you, you become easy to manipulate. Mm -hmm. If you are going to represent students on financial exclusion, exclusion fully so, mm -hmm. without the, fe the fear of uh, uh, being a victim, you, you would keep your hands clean away from corruption. What do you mean manipulated by management? It sounds to me that the president is saying that our management is corrupt, but anyway. Uh, so do you believe that there are temptations? Yes, there are temptations. Can you enlighten us on some of the temptations that are there? Well, I was in the SRC before, okay. and not as a president. Uh, temptations are there to, to, to defraud the SRC. And some of us, we pride ourselves that uh, to, to up until today, such things we have not committed, and uh, enlightening the students. When I say people. when I say such things, I mean fraud, fraud, fraud. Uh, being fraudulent as an SRC member uh, are things that some of us, particularly I can stand here and say me, yes. as an SRC member, I have never benefited personally. My next guest is. Cabal of students, University of Limpopo, and and discuss <laughs> their problems and issues which are affecting them, affecting them on a high level. In a sense, yes. Uh, did you have a POA? And if yes, what was your POA? I did have a POA, 
My PIA was to draft a transport policy, which I did. <coughs> it was also to um, to change condos and give student advances, which also I managed to do that. And also it was to review the contract of the child, that it should be terminated in due course. And also, coming to the hurricanes and all those things, I mean, it's, it's people, people want to be famous on some different uh, level. We all want to be famous with, with things that we do differently. People want to be famous. People want to be who famous. Who wants to be famous? The you person who writes the tsunami or, or, or the hurricanes or what? Definitely, I don't think you can sit down in your room and write bad stuff about yourself. It's a person who writes, who wants to be seen and to be heard. So if ever, uh, what I would urge students is that a student must read political journals and also student must also be keen in understanding what's going on around them so that uh, they can assist or they can have constructive criticism towards their leaders. That is allowed, this, that is allowed. Maybe, maybe because we don't have a suggestion box as SRC, then they can't suggest such things, but you can approach them. I mean, they're approachable, they're human beings. You can approach them and talk to them. My next guest is Mr. Lerumo Motla. Thank you very much, sir, for joining us, Mos Funugas. Uh, Mr. Lerumo, uh, the position that you're currently holding in the SRC office is that of Deputy President Internal Affairs. Am I right? Yeah, you're definitely correct. Guided by the SRC Constitution, we believe that you are second in command in the absence of the President and you are also able to coordinate the learning activities on campus. Can you please enlighten the students as to what that means? Okay, basically what it means is that uh, as a Deputy President in Tena, uh, what happened is that I, I deputize in the absence of the President, meaning that when the president is not is not around, I resume the duties of the president. Are you ready to take on the position that you've already taken on? Uh, in fact, when during the first meeting of the SRC we had, when we were elected into the office, I mean when we were allocated position, I did uh, in front of the chief electoral office yes. declare that I'm ready mm -hmm. to hold that particular portfolio, and that was not a mistake, and I still feel strong that I'm ready to hold that particular portfolio and I'm ready to face the challenges uh, that that portfolio may bring to me and I'll definitely serve in the interest of the students as I was deployed from my organization to do that. Well, it rained hurricanes, it rained tsunamis. Today, Nam it's raining Sfunugwazi. Fellow students, Spunugazi is here to stay. With your support, we're going to go a long way because we as students really want to know. I want to thank my guests that were here today and say that they must just keep it up and do a good job, especially to the current SRC. We're looking forward to seeing what you have in store for us.